Hello and welcome to Light of Knowledge. Dear friends, today we are back with a fresh episode where we will be exploring human life once again. And we have received a lot of questions from different people from different walks of life. And as we explore this, we will get to know ourselves better. So, in order to dive deep into this, we have Dr. Girish Patel once again in the studio. You have known Girish Patel for long. He is a wonderful speaker, a motivational speaker, an author, and a psychotherapist who deals with the problems of the mind. So, without much ado, let us welcome him to the studio. Sir, welcome back. Uh, it has been very interesting. I have watched most of your shows True. and uh, and the way you, you handle uh, different problems has been very convincing and very, very interesting. So, I have a question here which I thought is very interesting, which is a, is a bit different from the normal kind of problem we get. Here, uh, uh, someone asked, he hasn't mentioned his name. He said, what type of person I am, I don't know. Mm. I don't have convincing skills. Mm -hmm. He's saying convincing skills. No public speaking skills. I don't have good listening and speaking skills. Mm -hmm. What should I do? I can't keep focus on things. And it seems like I'm leading an aimless life. Mm -hmm. uh, please help me out. So I thought, doctor, this is a very interesting multifaceted true, question. True, yeah, very, very true. Because, mm -hmm. because uh, what do you think on the outset when yeah. you hear such yeah, a question? Yeah, yeah de definitely the, it is no multifaceted. Yes. Mm. As he says that my life is aimless. Mm -hmm. So maybe he doesn't have clear cut goals, one yes, thing. Yes. Secondly, I see that way even that he has low self-esteem. Okay. He is saying both the things mm -hmm. that I don't have speaking skills, I don't have listening skills. Yes, yes. Speaking skills, I agree mm -hmm. that we need some training, you need some practice. Okay. But listening skill, you don't need anything. Okay, okay. You just need to listen. Okay. So here it's unique. Mm. This part I agree that he doesn't have speaking skills. But when he says I don't have listening skills also, mm, mm. which is very easy. Okay. What I think, you know, although we need to go into details, mm -hmm. but basically he has low self-esteem. Okay. He doesn't accept himself. Yes, yes. And yes, then yes. second may be possibly mm. that, as I said, he doesn't have goals in life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Secondly, I think somehow, somewhere, he don't want to put effort also. Mm. There, is a, there are two types of people. There are people who blame others. Yes, there yes. are many who would mm. blame for their problem everybody else. Mm -hmm. Where here he is blaming himself. Yes. That yes. I am not good. I don't have this. I don't have this. So if he... Mm. Works on that particular maybe, maybe area a little bit. On that area, uh, he it is good, right? Because he at least know that I have some problem. I need to correct that. So uh, that, he can that's start from no, there. that's perfect. That is accepting. Mm -hmm. But such individual generally, you know, they do speak such things. That okay. I don't have this. I don't have this. Here mm -hmm. he is talking about his skills. Yes. Yes. <laughs> And w when I heard this, doctor, I thought, what if you don't have speaking skills? You might have other skills. Mm -hmm. But some, somehow, he seems to be obsessed with this particular thing. Mm -hmm. This is what I thought. Yeah, Isn't yeah. It? He's uh, talking more and more about, you know, public speaking skills. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What if you don't have, is it such a, you know, if you don't have this skill, mm -hmm. uh, does it mean that you cannot go forward in life? No, perfectly. Even if you don't have, you can. There are many. Mm -hmm. There are many type of jobs yes. which you need not be a good communicator. Mm. Mm. But yet, suppose if he wants to develop, say. Still is possible. Suppose, huh, yeah, mm. it's, it's not that difficult. Mm. Just we have to put little effort. Mm. Sometimes we discuss in detail also. But if he puts little effort and then be yourself. Okay. Don't be like somebody else. Mm. Mm. Even in the beginning, when I started going abroad, okay. I used to ask na, in audience, there were good, very famous people, mm. that you please correct me. Okay. So, 
टू थ्री ऑफ देम टोल्ड मी दैट डॉक्टर यू हैव योर इंडिविजुअल स्टाइल डोंट चेंज ओके यू बी बी योर सेल्फ एज यू प्रोग्रेस यू विल बी नोन फॉर योर स्टाइल एंड टूडे आई थिंक इट्स ट्रू like but yes people yes people know there are some would make mimicry that uh, how i speak yes. but okay. it's it fits perfect mm-hmm. everybody does that mm-hmm. then you have developed a unique style yes, of yes. communicating to others yes. and i have seen that people do like your style very much uh, yes no, and that so like no i have not picked up from any textbook okay or no institute has taught hmm automatically that has come Mm, that is being being uh-huh. original uh-huh. right that is what i am and, and then maybe some mm. corrections can come yes but you need a lot of confidence for this right doctor because i know that i have a unique style and i don't need to copy anyone i don't need to be uh, too influenced by anyone mm. to to what can a person do when i when you were saying this i was thinking this is very good advice but even everyone needs mm. uh, uh, to improve on this i also want to know mm. how can i be a unique person as mm. you said mm-hmm. because uniqueness needs a lot of self confidence self assurance mm-hmm. so how can it develop these things here brother self confidence seems little difficult well do this sort of words like mm. self confidence will power yes yes but what you need is i'm repeating here once again self esteem okay okay that you just start liking yourself the way you are yeah and then don't be influenced by others opinion hmm or don't hmm. give importance to others opinion don't keep asking i'm good i'm good i'm good then if you ask no there will be few who will say no no you are not good hmm and you will take that inside <laughs> hmm so some would definitely say that your style is not good hmm in case suppose out of 10 if 6 or 7 tells you that say your body language is not good mm. the way in which you stand reflects no say your lack of confidence okay. or something as if no you are not sure then maybe you change mm. but if one or two person tells you don't worry and most important advice to such individual is never never go and ask everybody <laughs> expert mm. fine like as mm. i did mm. if there are people who are no really in that particular field so who are anchors who are mm. public speakers and then you can ask them okay that if there is something you please watch me okay, okay. and advise mm. then they may give you some advice if at all you need to ask find the right person uh, yeah yeah they, they, mm. they should be really expert mm. in that field mm. Otherwise, maybe one of the reason why he is so depressed with himself is maybe uh, the people around him uh, he might not have you know uh, put much focus on that mm-hmm. because we uh, read a lot you know don't be with toxic people don't be with negative people who find faults in you and it it will be a natural confidence you know buster for you true so the company is very important that's what you're pointing out no this is also perfect mm-hmm. that uh, the group mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. since childhood in fact yes yes not yes. later on mm mm-hmm. psychology says that first 7 years are most important of a person's life ah, because no first 7 years you are always at your subconscious level oh whatever someone says there is a immediate effect first 7 years you are in a subconscious mind almost like why why now okay. no logic behind it that till 7 years no child is not thinking much logically oh yes, yes if you tell child you are stupid then you are stupid oh like before few days only one of my relatives she is hardly 11 year old she came and showed me that look this what i have written it was really wonderful mm. Mm. when i praised i said that even my handwriting are not so good and these days the children write in third fourth on her face also no it there was the real change okay now this has gone in her subconscious somewhere mm. and always she would think yes my handwriting are good instead if someone says your handwriting are very bad you don't know how to write 
you need lot mm -hmm. then no mm -hmm. that might go that i i don't know how to yes, write yes yes yeah. doctor you are pointing out something very important because uh, the childhood uh, management of a child by mm. the parents and mm. the society if there is a little bit of logic and sense in that maybe such question won't arise later right uh, but Lord, such you no know, blocks like yes, what yes. we see you know mm. this if we talk to him more this might reflect some depressive traits okay maybe Which he we might have caught up from the childhood no now he might have developed okay it may not be since childhood mm. maybe within few months or years okay but in general if we talk about him then one possibility mm. like you know, in this show our goal is prevention yes yes and we you know many are watching yes. how they can prevent such thing of course of course so i think in such cases most important thing they have developed some sort of blocks in their consciousness mm. for example in his case mm. he might have developed this sort of a block that i'm not good mm. i don't know anything okay i don't have convincing skill as he says so these are no offshoots Oh. but basics may be something that i am not good at anything mm -hmm. i cannot do anything properly mm. and then such thing will come as he says i am not a good listener even i am not a good speaker it it feels like a continuous negative ha, self talk at right? least you are one of them mm -hmm. either good speaker or a good listener yes yes so no that's why they have developed certain blocks mm. and which ultimately can result into anxiety into depression okay. it can okay. result into even ocd mm -hmm. you know there are levels i have discussed there are almost seven levels of depression okay, okay. so no where they are and then first goal in such cases is like no without medicine <laughs> Okay. Medici meditation can be a good way okay so such uh, problems doesn't require a medication that is uh, what you are no, saying at times like no if it is too much okay suppose mm. if he is really feeling too depressed mm. if mm. his sleep is affected mm. if he has a suicidal tendency if his work is affected if he is not able to do work properly at workplace if no constantly they are complaining mm. that your performance is not at all good then he need experts advice okay otherwise even self help technique can help yes yes no no many I of our programs in godly yes, wood studio yes. where no we have discussed that how to really accept yourself mm. as you are mm. yes and fine everybody has some strength maybe someone has 80% weakness but 20% strengths are there and you can focus on that 20% those strengths so weakness mm -hmm. would automatically reduce yes yes this this really is i think uh, anyone who is watching doctor this is what the key i think you mm -hmm. what you have just said because you have at least 20% percentage mm -hmm. which you can build on ah. but but the, your focus is on what you don't have mm -hmm. that becomes a damaging thing true true right mm -hmm. so so i think uh, this is an era of of internet and in information explosion mm -hmm. uh, wherever i see nowadays even after the covid and the pandemic mm -hmm. uh, uh, a new trend which i am looking at is there are courses everywhere like you know uh, of self help things mm -hmm. and you know it is it has flooded the internet true true right so anyone can Uh, I, I take advantage from that mm -hmm. and i have seen that they are not charging much also nowadays true true and then very good, very good low nominal. cost uh -huh. good classes mm -hmm. so i i mean anyone can make it a routine i'm mm -hmm. asking you mm -hmm. this is a, i think this is a good possibility that you you spend one hour a day mm -hmm. to listen to something positive maybe this negative self talk can can reduce yeah, it, it, it right? can it can definitely mm. what you are saying also is true but they should know then really choose a proper course no which yes, would help yes, yes. another simple although i am not advertising but i feel no oh, youtube is wonderful mm, yes yes <laughs> i am not associated no, no, in yes, any yes, way because social media <laughs> has a lot of power mm. no yes. many not say that no youtube is free there is nothing this that 
But then no, in YouTube, if you take advantage, suppose if you see a specific video, hmm. then they will send you other videos Connected related to, to it. Ha. Yes, yes. There yes. if you can choose mm -hmm. that this is what I need. Yes. And yes. then wherever you find that this particular person is really giving Doctor, good Doctor, advice, actually, then self-help can help. I, actually, I don't find a problem with that because uh, by recommending you videos mm -hmm. which you like, which you mm -hmm. can take advantage of, YouTube is also earning their own money. That's fine. Fine, because it's a mutual <laughs> kind of benefit. Why no? I am saying yes, yes. Because oh, they are not charging us. Yes, they are charging yes. advertiser. Yes. That's fine. Yes. <laughs> Yes. Advertiser is okay, but at and, least and no, for viewers it is we free. We can take free advantage. Huh. Okay. There are no many where viewers they are charging, hmm. Hmm. which I feel. If you can, it's perfect. Mm. Those who are affording is okay. Yes, yes. But at least no, lower middle class people yes. who can't afford, yes. for them this can be a wonderful. And no, because that way it is free, mm -hmm. this is a huge sort of things. Yes. Yes. If you can search, you just need to search a little bit. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of information, whichever area you need, it is available. When you, you started meditation, mm -hmm. Because you have a, a long time experience in meditation, and how did you start? Uh, you might also uh, might have had certain areas of low self-esteem or low confidence, maybe. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what did you do uh, when you started to, in order to you know develop yourself, or in uh -huh. order to? Actually, I have already shared, but yet not again to share this. My goal was concentration. Okay, I was from vernacular medium. Oh. And then goal was to go into medical college. Okay. So like when you go to college, you are going to compete with English medium. Yes, yes. And at that time, there was no other exam. Hmm. Like that was inter science. Okay. So 12th now, whatever mark you get, and in say Maharashtra, according to that merit, Say in Mumbai, med in medicine, maybe at that time, 600 seats. Okay. No private colleges. So if you are among 600, you will get, otherwise no, okay. nothing, nothing okay. doing. So I thought, no, it's a horrible competition. Mm -hmm. And that's how, no, I start, first I started with yoga, in fact, no, yoga, okay. like Ashtang yoga, no, mm -hmm. asana and all. Yes, yes. There was a free course. So I did that course and I felt good. Mm. And then subsequently I did Brahma Kumari's meditation. Okay which also helped a lot. Then honestly, I lost connection for two years because okay. my focus was studies. Mm -hmm. Then after two years, I started regularly. Okay. And that indeed helped because at that time also a lot of competition was there. Even after going into medical college, mm -hmm. in best of the medical college, still a lot of competition was there. Mm -hmm. So their meditation really helped. And, uh, and, and you know, did you use specific affirmations? That is what I wanted to know because uh, this person is asking the question. Uh, as you said, uh, he is feeling uh, low on self-esteem. So uh, the first thing in the morning maybe should be, you know, to uh, you say something or you think something yeah, so yeah. that you understand your own importance. Yeah, yeah. More than I didn't do it. honestly, you know, I should tell what I have done. Okay. Somebody okay. other will say, yes, 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 I did. I have not done anything. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I was interested in meditation. like no? okay. I was okay. exploring meditation technique. Mm. But later on, when I learned psychology, mm. to answer his question, it is wonderful. Mm. Like, as I said, till seven years, your subconscious is active. Mm. And after that, there are three times in a day okay. when no, automatically you are in contact with your subconscious. Okay. One is as soon as you wake up. Mm. Early morning Like hours. when you wake up and you get up, yes. there is a little time gap. So that time it is very good. I mean, just only that short period of time or maybe early morning hours, can you say? No, no? if that is, I will tell you later, this is one. Mm. But no, that is powerful time. Okay. If someone can design, like suppose no, in his case, hmm. if he can design some affirmation like, I accept myself as I am. Hmm. Hmm. I am improving day by day. Okay. My goals are becoming clear day by day. Hmm. Hmm. Even though those two, three minutes can be powerful. Okay. And second time is when you are falling asleep. Okay. So just when you're, uh, yeah, bed. just mm. that last thought is very important. Mm. 
सो इफ यू कैन गिव सच एफर्मेशन दैट माई कॉन्फिडेंस इज इंक्रीजिंग आई एम डेवलपिंग क्लैरिटी इन माई लाइफ Indeed, in the, it will go in the subconscious. Mm. He might mm. get such dreams only. Okay, so these are the two time points. Ah, third time is after bathing. Okay. I generally suggest that arrange your schedule in such a way so that you no, know, after bathing you have at least ten minutes. You don't have to rush. Okay, after bathing in the if, sense, if you can, it just can be in the morning or in the uh, evening. Yeah, in the evening, any time. Okay. but then no if you can just lie down mm. so automatically you know that good feeling is there mm-hmm. just lie down for a while mm-hmm. relax whatever and then give affirmation this is wonderful uh-huh. this wonderful. and then few times mm-hmm. even meditation can help okay just after taking a bath that is one thing apart from that at mm. least you no know, twice find some maybe 10 minutes 7 minutes minimum but i just to want to i just want to stay a little bit longer there because uh, that that triggered something i yeah, yeah. i uh, we all have listened to archimedes and uh, yeah, how yeah. we developed yeah, ideas yes, after yes, taking yes. a bath mm-hmm. because many people say that when you when you you know good ideas come when yeah. you are you know taking a bath and some people even have i know people who have done that and used that technique to their own benefit so uh, this is wonderful i didn't know about the bath thing because people usually know that early morning hours and evening hours are good but you have made it even more specific like you know a few minutes immediately after you get up mm. and uh, uh, just before you fall asleep no actually bathing is wonderful after as you said no i mean i have seen i get many solutions while bathing okay yeah yeah and i sp- it's a routine in fact hmm. that after hmm. bathing i spare at least 15 minutes where i will lie down like you no know, in a relaxed position and then try to relax one thing maybe go in little meditative state and give some affirmations for hmm. that day okay now you know, after that i'm going to go in the clinic so for that i would give some affirmation mm, mm. something like you know at this age you know that energy sometimes reduces okay. so you no know, my energy level is going to be great mm. no? the more i work the more energetic <laughs> I, I, i like that <laughs> i give some affirmations mm, mm. so and in it it indeed works okay then you, know, you are very cool and because you are cool there can be problems there can be difficult cases some other problems but then you are able to handle them no very very stably very peacefully doctor that is wonderful um, i think uh, that has been answered quite well because mm-hmm. the basic thing you said is there is a lack of self esteem mm-hmm. which triggers many more things mm-hmm. and the best way to tackle it is to you know understand your importance mm-hmm. telling yourself in the early morning hours and before True. you go to bed True. so that i think can be a good starting point for uh, for our dear friend who has asked this question mm-hmm. and many more who mm-hmm. has similar kind of oh, problems so thanks a lot for our uh, this discussion we'll see you in the next yeah, episode thank you so dear friends uh, we all know about affirmations and we all know about you know self help things but making it a point to do it regularly can work wonders uh, solutions are the same but the way we apply it and how consistent we are on this will bring you results for the person who has asked this question i think uh, we have hit on the on the solution you have a lot of things in you where you can focus because even if you think 80% you don't have anything there is a 20% or even at least if it is a 5% when you once you focus on that 5 it will start to grow because where you fo- where your focus goes because where your focus goes energy flows that's a common concept which we all know so on that note we end this episode and we'll meet you with another question in the next one thanks a lot for listening